one day at a time. Uh, it was a long three days, but I kind of had a race each day to distract myself. But uh, it was a lot of fun. Did you, were there any doubts when you were warming up? I mean, how heavy were the legs this morning? You know what? It's hard to distinguish tired legs from just sore legs. My legs were sore, um, you know, from running 12 and a half laps and spikes. That wasn't easy. But um, yeah, I just, you know, I wouldn't have attempted the double if I didn't think I could do it. I don't think it's right to enter races that you don't think, you know, you have a shot in or that you can give your best effort. And I'm just so strong right now that I knew I could give my best effort, whether that was a win or not, but I'm happy that they were both wins. Do you think it was to your advantage to have a slow pace? Like if it would have been torrid from the beginning, yeah. you know, like a 4 weight pace, would that have been to, you, to your disadvantage? Yeah. Um, Oh, it's hard to say. You know, I, I ran 411 a while ago this year. It was my first race of the season, and so not a whole lot of girls are going to run away from me when I can run that, you know, not entirely sharp. Um, but then again, we went out in about 70, which I think actually might have been what the 5K went out in la uh, last night. It was like 71 or something, and it didn't feel the same as last night. Last night felt smooth. It felt a little different today. But... Uh, you know, I was definitely ready for any pace. I was almost hoping it would be fast to kind of string it out because things can get uh, really rough when uh, there's a lot of girls in, in the pack. So, you know, by whatever pace I, I wanted to win. So, Is this your best accomplishment yet? And if so, uh, what else can you do to top this? <laughs> um, definitely on the track. You know, it, it's, it's hard to compare to the cross-country team titles, definitely, because right. that's something you get to share with, with other people. But th this was fantastic. I... You know, I couldn't even think straight when I crossed the finish line. I gave probably the most embarrassing celebration ever. But, um, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm so ecstatic right now. It hasn't totally sunk in even.